Welcome to another episode of WLS Tutorials. In this one, I'm quickly going to show you how to basically group or technically correct bus uh, channels in Logic Pro. Um, well, the, what this basically does, it allows you to um, basically control different uh, channels from the same place. Um, I don't know if I can play it for you because this screen recorder doesn't actually record system audio so what I'm going to do is I'm going to move my microphone towards the speaker and let you hear the difference first of all before I put some of in fact no that's not the point of this tutorial um, so yeah uh, so what you basically do is you go to the first channel and then you go here where it says stereo out and then you hold that down and you go to bus and you put bus one and then you just basically do it for all of them so because I've got a string section on these three uh, what I do is I'm going to put this string section all of these on the same bus Oops. Come on. bus one and then um yeah so basically that's simple then you put all of your your settings on this bus one now what I've done here I'll just show you how I did that quickly as I created a new channel called instrument one um, and then what I did was I said I want to reassign track mixer um, auxiliary and auxiliary bus one which basically allows me to do that and sorry about those two noises that was um that was people texting me that doesn't happen often <laughs> Um, so yeah, now that's just a quick one. So what we do now is we just play it and then you can see here when we press X we have our bus one just here and Yeah, basically that makes your life a whole lot or easier. We'll call this strings and then um, yeah, like I said, I would play a few in fact, do you know what I'm doing? I'm gonna put it in the background so you can hear uh, How it sounds but other than that this has just been yet another quick pull of W tutorials and as always thank you very much for watching